you have to forget a lot of the things you've, you've, you've learnt or think you know about building a hospital and thinking about, start thinking about building a community centre. Um, and it requires a very different change in mindset. As the NHS are building their community diagnostic hub plans, they can look at One Welbeck from its inception to where it is today, how it benefits patients within their community, and how it can help the efficiency of the acute trust by taking those diagnostic procedures that can come out of the hospital into a CDH facility on the high street like this one is here today. So we have about 200 doctors here in central London. We have converted a building that was essentially an office building into a clinic that can pretty much do 80% of what a hospital can do. And every clinic is almost designed around a specific specialty. So that's the way the groups operate. They treat patients as a team, not just as an individual. The patient will find their way to that doctor quite quickly in here. So it's incredibly convenient and it's incredibly accessible. You don't need a lot of the infrastructure that you have in a hospital to do diagnostics. We didn't want to just sell equipment. We worked in consultation, in partnership with them. We looked at how what is the best design of the facility, looking at patient pathways and patient flows and also having an understanding of the requirements from a staff perspective as well. We have to make sure that our training enables the team here to cope with those demands, to manage those demands. We actually have doctors here, our, our, our radiologists who are involved in research programs as well, some of which involve GE equipment, particularly on long COVID. We have a whole bunch of those programs going on at any, any one time. We've started really from the ground up. We sort of took over from, from the operations and the builders uh, and we started really thinking about the patient journey. And that starts really back in the background of policies, procedures, writing and making sure that every single outcome possible is risk assessed, is taken care of to ensure the patient's highest level of safety, security and the best possible imaging for the doctors. We've been very excited about GE's dedication to excellence in imaging and also the willingness to work with us on areas that we think collectively we can do better on. I'd love to call out some of the GE equipment that I just think is truly world class. We found the MRI imaging excellent. The thing that has really surprised us has been the CT as well. I mean, we find the Revolution is a phenomenal machine. When we were working with One Well Beck in terms of the design of the facility, we were always looking at what would be the best patient experience. Experience in terms of efficiency, but also experience in terms of calming the patient down, making the patient feel relaxed as they came into the facility. So what's going to happen is clinics are going to be reimagined around these quicker diagnostics that are more in the clinic. We would like to be recognised as the sort of highest quality, easiest to access, most convenient diagnostic and outpatient interventional business that there is. And I think GE shares that ambition with us. The key things that make it a partnership with One Well Beck, it's based on openness of discussion, it's based on transparency of the relationship. We're always looking at how we could do things better together. It's how we could leverage our skills and competence in facility design that would enable the facility to look like it does today. And looking at something that not only is good and very relaxing and calming for the patients, but also a really nice place for staff to work.